Joining me on the broadcast right now is YS Rajan, the former ISRO scientist. He's live with us from Bengaluru. Sir, thank, thank you very much for speaking with us here at Beyond. Um, if I can begin by asking you, do you find uh, NASA's comments surprising, especially after the U.S. itself uh, expressed no objection or any sort of uh, explicit concern about the debris issue after India's ASAT test? Thank you. <clears throat> Actually, that whole talk has to be seen. So, you know, the news is sensational when you give a nice title. The same talk the NASA administrator has said, uh, this is Sarah Levin's report. The good thing, it is low enough in the orbit that over time, this will all dissipate. Whereas much of the debris from the 2000 Chinese anti-satellite test is still in orbit. I don't know whether the last one he said or not. The earlier one is much of it will be dissipated. Another thing, same article, Bernstein added later, despite this increased risk, the astronauts are still safe and the International Space Station will be maneuvered if needed to avoid the debris, though it is unlikely that this will be necessary. All right. Okay. This is the thing. Actually, it's a very small thing. India has chosen the more or less the same orbit which U.S. did on U.S. 193 in February 2008. The same, 250 kilometers. It's very tough to do it there, but it will go off in a few weeks. It will be out. Okay, so can so, I ask you this? What do you make of NASA's uh, also the comment about the risk to the ISS and how it increased by 44% following India's ASAT test? Yeah, yeah. Risk, is always, risk is something of uh, mathematical calculation. After saying it only, he said, Despite the increased risk, the astronauts are still safe. The International Space Station will be maneuvered if needed to avoid, though it is unlikely that it will be necessary. These are all statistical. Very, very unlikely. See, even Indian launches, when they do, you would have seen that sometimes the news report, it was delayed by few minutes to avoid a debris. Sure. So there are so many debris around. So here... It is so, only 24 are to be worried about. The 24 will be above. That's what increases the risk. But at the same time, you need 10 centimeters. He has also told that it's not there. It's unlikely that we have to maneuver. If it is to be maneuvered, it will be done. So in other words, the orbit chosen has been very careful. India has studied the earlier ones, uh, it appears, because the, the Chinese one is so much, 100,000. 100, 100,000 and something like, uh, uh, I'll tell you, uh, uh, some 2,600 of, and they will all come down. Right. Whereas here, it is in that orbit, slightly few of them are there, and they will all come down within a matter of weeks. They will burn. All right. It's Professor Raja, uh, thank you for uh, clearing yes, all that up for us. Um, also, of course, uh, perhaps the use of the word terrible by uh, the NASA chief had, uh, you know, set alarm bells ringing. We leave it at that. Thank you very much, sir. For